you everybody, it's the Dear Rock 100. Welcome back to more Pokemon XD Gale of Darkness. Last time, we finished up everything we can do here at Agate Village and we purified our three shadow Pokemon. This time, we are going to be heading off for Mount Battle after being advised to do so. Anyway, I know that Titty or so grew up a level, but not much has really changed after that. So, yep, Rock to Mount Battle. Well, hello. It's you. Well, well, didn't we meet at Gattonport? Have you come to train? This is an excellent place for people to train. I've trained here myself. Back then, I always sought to become more powerful. I didn't need any other reason. As a result, I attained this status. But now, I've taken him to questioning my motive for gaining power. I wonder how what I'm finding for. I ponder if I am putting my Pokemon under cruel stress. That's why I urge uh, you to look into yourself. Ask yourself why you want to become stronger before you take that path. Quite the wise old man. Whoops. Did not want to do that. I thought there was an uh, item black somewhere over here. So it looks like it's a no-go. Uh, Mount Battle does have one fair use, but that's not going to be until much, much later on. Now, I know this is a side quest, but I don't think I'm going to be doing this. Because I don't want to waste all the hassle on doing that. But anyway, here at Mount Battle, we have ourselves the restoration spot. And we have our Pokemon right here. By... Oh, there's a coupon exchange. Never mind. Now, I wish that I had a, a Pokemon that actually sells us with Pokeballs, but I don't see that happening for a while. Um, actually, you know what? I need to do something real quick. Come on. Give me... Here we go. Oh, that's right. It's a little bit different than this. So, here we go. I'm just moving that into the PC storage. Since I really don't need Ladybug at the time, but anyway. Welcome to Mount Battle. Would you care to take our challenge for training? You battle until you're knocked out. Fortunately, we're not open to the public right now. The facilities are closed for training novice trainers. Oh, now here to train? You came to see Vander, one of our arena leaders? Actually, Vander is in charge of the rookie training session. He's inside right now. If you if you're in a hurry, you may enter through here. Why thank you. Okay. Do this quick. I got a water bottle next to me because I am in desperate need for it. Anyway. Hello. Oh, I just finished training now, but a challenger is already here? What to do, what to do? Oh, I don't know, what to do? Just shut up and battle me. Alright, Miru. See what you got. Alright. Umber and Teddy Yersa. I probably should have had my other Pokemon... My other shot. My, I cannot speak today. Good lord. I probably should have brought out Kujiana for this. But no big deal. Not gonna hurt anything. Why is that thing not a Silkun or a Cascoon yet? Dang, that thing had some punch. Umbra's at level 13, very nice. Uh oh. Fortunately, I didn't get poison from that, which is nice. So we'll go over the nice tackle to the face. Very well. Now that we got that way, well, I knew what you weren't. We weren't ready. I almost thought I'm, you weren't ready. Ugh. Oh, you came to save Vander, so I wasted a battle on you. 
Vendor is teaching some rookie trainers in a zone up ahead. Well, thank you for telling me about that. So I'll go ahead and put Poochiana up in the front. I'm not going to use Poochiana nor Teddy Ursa on my team. But we're actually getting pretty close into finding a couple of more Pokemon that I want to use on my team. But anyway. I'm really nervous. I wonder if I can make it as a trainer. So I hold a Pokeball in my right hand like this. Oh, I forget. Oh, forget it. I'm, I'll just try it instead of thinking about it. Indeed. Alright, casual. I'm going to do Criddle. But some people used to call it just Cuddle from high school. <laughs> okay. I'm good. Alright. That. And let's try a poison fan on that core pitch. Alright. Whoops. That's probably not gonna work. Uh oh. What am I worried about? Oh god. And it's using Harden. Phenomenal. Alright, let's mix it up a little bit. There we go. Nice. Whoa, Pucci is level 13. Very nice. Sure. Do that. Uh, let's say goodbye to Hill Bell. I'm never going to use that. Poochiana has learned Bite. I, well, I guess you could say since Poochiana is kind of a pooch, his bark is worse than its bite. <laughs> uh, okay. Alright, here we go. All too easy. All right. Wow, you're making me lose confidence. Hey, you brought that on yourself, there, Bob. You went to train to be trained to be training in Area One, huh? You come to see Vander? Oh, no wonder. I think Wander is still teaching out there. You may even see him in the next zone. Alright. Is this the guy in question? That's right. In a, ugh. in a double battle, it's important that you understand the attributes and abilities of two Pokemon together. Okay, Vander, it makes sense. Oh? Are you a knockout battle challenger? I hate to disappoint you, but we're not running the challenge right now. We're in training, you see. Oh? You get sent you to see me? Oh, to hear about the desert. The desert, excuse me. Understood. I'll be happy to give you my account. But before I do that, I've got a little request. Just on appearance, you look like to be an outstanding trainer. I'm certain my eyes aren't deceiving me. So here's my request. To finish up my novice trainer session, I'd like you to treat him in a battle. Thank you for training with me. You got it, bud. This is Bardo right here. Alright, Bardo. This is what you got. Ooh, you got some good ones. That Doe Duo, especially. In fact, I think that Doe Duo might actually be a little bit concerning. Alright. Go for a double bite. Alright. Uh oh. Owie! Your psychic attacks are useless to my darkness the team. Alright. You know what? You haven't used Dig yet, so let's do that. There we go. One down. Dig a hole, dig a hole, dig a hole. <laughs> And you know what? Just to be a kick in the face, I'll kick sand in your face. 
Okay, I'll bark sand in your face. All right. I feel like I failed my school graduation exam. Oh, that's terrible. I hate it when that happens. But anyway. Yes, just as I thought. That was a well-played battle. Why, it made me want to jump in and join the fray too. Anyways, we should talk. But this isn't the place for that. Let's go back to a reception. In that there's a south of here, there's a cyber research facility. It's been there since the Shadow Pokemon incident. It seemed to be abandoned for a long time, but recently, I've seen groups of shady characters going inside. This is where the research lab was at. Shady characters uh, were seen at the lab in the desert in the south. Are they somehow connected to Professor Crane's abduction? Well, my good sir. Vander, my good sir. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you for your waiting. Thank you. And now I will skedaddle. Whoa, hello. Hi, Michael. Doing good? You can call today to inform us that the Pokeballs are now available at the Agahu Pokemart. You won't have to worry about running out anymore. Good luck, Michael. Thank you! Now I can finally go back and get some balls. Because. When you're handling your balls, you're just going to gently caress them, gently hey, handle with such a thing. What am I talking about? <laughs> I ain't no Markiplier. But now that I'm able to get some more Pokeballs... Ugh. Ain't that, that's, not, that's not an innuendo of any kind. Ugh. Okay. Now, let's see what you get. Okay, normal Pokeballs, but still, very nice. You know what? Give me 20! Put the Premier Ball into it, so I should now be good with the balls. Don't you guys dare make jokes. <laughs> okay. So now that I'm done hey, buying some Pokeballs, let's just head off. I need to get off of that subject, goddamn. The Mystery Facility. Whoa, hello. What do we have here? This must be that research facility. Whoa. We are uh, sex two blitz. We are, we are. We try terror throughout the land, for we are the Hexagon Brothers. Sound off! One, two, three, four, five! Wait, five? That's it. Five? Aren't we missing someone? That's ridiculously impossible. Let me try this time. Count off! One, two, three, four, five! See? What did I say again? There's someone missing. But anyway, though, enough. We'll return soon enough, I'm sure. What we need to do, brothers, is this. Lock and load on this suspicious kid. Hey, you brat! This is no kiddie playground. We've been away for a while, but this is a real estate belonging to Cypher for many a year. If you don't quit scurrying about, we'll have to tell your mommy. If you don't want that to happen, then run along home. Well, I got news for you, you hexagon weirdos. I'm gonna battle you, each and every one of you. The look on your face it says you're not about to listen and go home obediently. All right then, if you, I'll play with you for a while. <laughs> for a while, away at the time if you want. I can't talk to you, good lord. All right, bring it on. You're gonna want to fight these guys. In fact, there's something very sinister about each one of them. Show you.
Alright, so this guy's got Slugma and Hondauer, but believe it or not, Hondauer is indeed a Shadow Pokemon. Hondauer, as a Pokemon, it is a very good Pokemon that I would recommend for any team. Holy crap! A Dark Fire type? How can I not unrecommend this one? And holy crap, that's not good. Um. The only thing that I could really say about this one is that be sure that your ability is Flash Fire. Because honestly, I would love to have this one on my official team. Flash Fire, good Pokemon, to, good ability to have for this very occasion. Alright. Shadowblast, please. Come on. Okay, good, good, good. You attacked Umbreon. Just the Pokemon I wanted you to hit. Alright. And... Bite! Alright. Alright. Smog. And you missed. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> what an idiot! <laughs> I like how it snarls on us like that. There we go. Chow. Woo, Umbra's at level 14. Very good, very good. Okay. Alright. You know what? Let's go! Uh... Find on Hondauer just in case if something goes wrong. But anyway, Snag Ball, we're ready. Launch! One! Two! Three! Ha <laughs> Green health! Perfect! You defeated Red Six. What the? You're not supposed to be tough! Hondauer joined the party. Alright, here we go. I guess I have to while away some time. Alright. Let's take a look at this Hondauer. Jeez, this is a lucky Hondauer. And yes! It's got flash fire for the ability! Just the ability that I needed! <laughs> and you know what? You guys are in for a little bit of a shock because Hondauer is the next member of my team! Now I know I got two shadow, got two dark type Pokemon, but hey, you got to care on such, and I don't think I've made this whole line properly clear enough. For me. We're battling Blue Six here. Of course, Blue Six is gonna have water types. Here we go, Umpra, Hamdower. All right. Shadow Blitz on that Goldeen because I think Goldeen's the one that's probably gonna worry me the most. Whoa! I guess that clears it up that fast. <laughs> All right. Spiel is indeed a Shadow Pokemon. Spiel is a nice water type. Honestly, I've actually kind of had. Thoughts on me using this on my team, but I actually decided against it, mostly due to the fact that while I do love Sveal to death, personally I've seen many people use this one particular Pokemon a few times, and I kind of don't want to use it as often as others have in the past. I'm not saying Sveal's a bad Pokemon. Sveal's a great Pokemon, but all I can really say, Sveal is a cute Pokemon. And I've seen a lot of people use them in the past, so there's a reason. Uh-oh. Ooh, Shadow Miss. That's not good. It, it lowers evasiveness. So that's not good. And of course I avoided that type, which is nice. I'm just biting. Let's go! Yeah! Okay. And... No critical. Oh! Oh! That's perfect! That's perfect! You like it! Alright, I'm gonna put another sand attack on you, just in case. 
And let's throw a Pokeball at it. Alright. Snag Ball set. Launch! One. Two. Three. Bullseye. <laughs> I am just doing too good in this playthrough. Okay. Nobody brat. Hey! You don't call me a brat! That's... A, that's Cassidy's job! I'll rip her off! Bitch. Okay. Now let's take a look at this feel. Man. It's got thick fat for the body barrier. That's just as I expected. Um... We don't know what his nature is. Usually when these Pokemon's natures are clouded up like that, that means... A lot of it has yet to be revealed to us. Alright, so I'll use it on you. And you go over there. Alright. You're next, Brosix. <laughs> Alright. Now, Bro6 will have two Pokemon this time. He'll have a Hootoot. Which I don't know why, because he has ground type. He's supposed to be ground. But I've learned to not mess up with... Video Game Logic. And speaking of Pokemon... Boltoy is a Shadow Pokemon. Boltoy! It's more of a... More of a wall than a special attacker, which is a very weird combination. Now, I'm not saying it's a bad Pokemon, I like it. But the problem that I have with it is, it's strictly more of a special wall, I think it is. I haven't really looked at the bios on these, but I do know that they're decent. But it does have a nice, uh, the ability levitate. And what makes this one even more awesome is that later on it'll have Earthquake, which is a damn good attack. Uh oh. Ow! Rude! Okay. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna risk it. I know it may seem kind of a bad idea, but... Okay. That's fine. That's fine. A critical hit on that. Even though it's kind of pointless, but still. Very nice. I'm gonna take care of the rest of these guys, and then we'll end the episode off right here. Okay. Keep up the pressure, you guys. Here we go. Oh! Oh! Don't scare me like that. Okay. Let's get it into a Pokeball. And pray we get it. Snag ball set. Launch! One! Two, three, woohoo! I am on fire! I will never do that again. Ugh. I said I haven't already been tone deaf enough as it is in my life. <laughs> okay. Isn't that enough already? Go play somewhere else. Not likely, boy. All right, let's see what you got. Well, I kind of knew on that one, right? But yeah, it's more of a special wall than some of the others. But, um... You know what? Yeah, 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 I'll do that. Alright, so... so you... Here... Alright, here we go. Alright, yellow boy. You're up. If you haven't guessed already, this is yellow six. Next one, purple six. And, and yellow is probably green six. Green six. Okay. Ooh, an electric and a chin chow. Let's go, boys! Our oh, boy in it. <laughs> okay. Um, 
I gotta be careful because I'm willing to bet that Electric has static for the ability. So, the quicker I take this thing down, the better. Okay. Really? Hmm. Uh oh. Who are you firing water at? Oh, you got Umbreon. You got Umbra wet. Alright, here we go. Got a Blitz. We'll knock that Chin Chow out. I need a good. Alright. Hurry! Is indeed a shadow Pokemon! Marie, that's a Pokemon! Honestly, you're not really missing out on this one. Well, actually, you could be missing out on this one because many people have back in the day of gold and silver and crystal. Well, I guess not really crystal because you can't get it. Everyone is using Marie. And honestly, I haven't either. I have not used this in my life. Okay, here we go. Uh oh. I kinda saw that one coming. Okay. Shadow Blitz. Uh oh. Well, okay, okay. I got no problems with that. Um, let's see here. Let's go for a Shadow Mist. There we go, that'll work. Okay. Yes, 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 yes. Blitz on me. That was weird. Okay. Okay. I'll use my one paralysis heal on Boltoid. Pretty good. All right. Skag ball set. Fire. One, two, three. Gotcha. <laughs> I am doing too good in this playthrough. Three down, and I think actually no, four down. And two to go. Okay. Yeah. You try to look busy, but actually we have nothing to do. It's like, it's not like we need to worry about any enemies in this desert. Oh, really? Unfortunately, I don't have Mareep with me at the moment, so... Nothing I can do on that one, but let's give Sveal a chance to shine. Here you go. A little kid like you should run on home to mommy. That's the best. Oh, is that so, Perp6? Okay, I gotta ask, are these code names? Because if they're code names, they're pretty terrible. Alright. So let's see here. And... Bite him in the face. Get out of my face, please. Thank you. Nice feel. Give it the shadow way! <laughs> oh, in all circumstances. This is going better than I expected. I really shouldn't say that. But then again, Umbreon is at level 15, which is nice. He's sending out Tentacool! Uh oh. Oh! He got hit by a, a sludge with a face on it. Okay, here we go. Karuga! Whoa! Critical hit! Okay, here we go. Gold pit! 
is indeed a shadow Pokemon. Golden is a very weird Pokemon, and it's labeled as the Stomach Pokemon. It's an interesting poison type, and it either has Liquid Ooze or Sticky Hole for the ability. Honest truth, I think you're far better off with Liquid Ooze. I don't intend on using this one particular Pokemon on my team, but honestly, I can't really recommend him this particular Pokemon that much. I'm not saying it's a bad Pokemon, but I just feel like it's not that good in terms of the ways of battle. Okay. Uh oh. Go. Very nice. There we go. Okay. Alright, we're off to a good start. Alright, let's see here. Okay, so I'm gonna bite on Gold, but pray we don't have a very powerful critical hit. Oh, okay. You know what? I think that might do. I think that might just do very nicely. And Shadow Hold? Oh no! It's pretty much a shadow version of Meemon. Shadow Mix! Alright. Alright, you know what? I'm feeling lucky today. You know that yesterday was my bad luck day? Not this time! My good luck stream is hopefully coming back to me, so snag ball set, fire at will. One, two, three! Wow! I, I, I'm sorry guys, but I really should not be playing right now because I am doing too good in this uh, playthrough. Oh mama, I lost! Are you relative to Wario? Because the way and how you said that kind of makes me feel like you're a relative to his. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we got one last guy, and then we'll finish up right here. Here we go. So this one has six Pokemon, but they're actually pretty easy to take out. Here we go. Got an Oddish. Executor. Ah, uh, this 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 executor. Okay. I'm so sorry. I just had to do it. Anyway, you know me rambling on about nothing. Let's just kick these guys in the ass. So like I said, they're easy to take out. We got nothing to worry about. Except maybe that. That might actually worry me. Because of that effect spore for the ability. Ugh. And then it flinch. Pretty good. So we'll use Shadow Blitz on that Shroomish. Hooray! This won't give us... Any status problems. Pretty good. Critical hit. I'll take it. Pretty good. I like it. Most excellent. Mm -hmm. Yes. Wotan is not a shadow Pokemon. Okay. <laughs> there we go. And what do you got next? Because I'm curious. And we haven't seen Hyper Mode in a while. Or not Hyper Mode. Uh, reverse Mode, I believe it is. Yeah, we haven't seen that happen yet. But we could be lucky. Okay. Alright, that low tad is pretty much just a fish out of water. <laughs> Alright, anyway, C Dot! Is indeed a shadow Pokemon! C Dot! This is a good grass type Pokemon that I would recommend. This thing, if used correctly, this thing is a monster. Because, if I recall correctly, I think C Dot. I think it learned Sunny Day by leveling up. and. If you want a good Sun Summoner, Seedot's your guy. It may start off pretty defensive, but if you're going to use this Pokemon, be absolutely sure it has Chlorophyll for the ability, and not Early Bird. 
Alright, here we go. Uh oh. Shadow Wave! Okay, here we go. I'm feeling lucky. I've been feeling lucky throughout this entire playthrough. Snag ball set. Fire. One, two, three. Oh my God! Oh, shout out Pokemon Con on the first ball. Uh, I should not be playing this because holy crap. Okay. <clears throat> this is nothing. Our brotherly love is nothing like this. Alright, anyway. So before I go, I just want to quickly say thank you guys so much for watching. As always, I know that I wasn't here yesterday. I was booked solid yesterday and I had no ways of recording at all yesterday. Of course, I did do a recording on my other channel for, um, with my, uh, with my friend Zucchino 101 on Pokemon Coliseum. We finally got into a corner on that, and we had a decent amount of progress on that one. But either way. And I almost uh, had the intention of doing no recording today because I actually got out of the medical uh, center earlier this morning. Ugh, it was not a happy fun trip. Okay. But anyway, I'm actually doing a whole lot better, and I can safely say I am now ready to proceed. Okay, but anyway, so before we go on, let's check out these Pokemon right here. Is that a good ability, which is nice. Okay, so it does have Liquid Ooze ability. Nice, because if a Pokemon has a move that can drain the HP, the draining causes injury rather than, than uh, absorbing health. But anyway. Please let this have a good ability! No! I didn't want to! I almost wanted to use this on my team, but if it had chlorophyll for the ability, I would have used it! Dang it! Oh well. But, oh well. But, guess what? I've also decided on something else. Mareep is the next member of my team! So, let's see here. Poochiana! You did good. You were great. So anyway, you know what? I'm satisfied with how this episode went. I'm very happy. We're ending this video off right here. So, next time, we're going deeper into the mystery facility and see if we can find this Professor Crane guy. See you guys then. I forgot about that. <laughs>